when we talk about top 10 toxins for dogs, there actually is published data every year from the Animal Poison Center about their top 10 calls. Human medications are always number one on the list, and that's followed by pesticides. Within pesticides, we can break those down to uh, rat poisons or rodenticides, insecticides, and then things like herbicides and fertilizers that we use on our, in our gardens and yards. Beyond that, it's, it tends to be veterinary drugs. Uh, one of the things that, that uh, we do in veterinary medicine to make medicating your pet easier is we, we're starting to make medications that are chewable and that are flavored so that dogs and cats will readily take those drugs. The problem with that is that when the dog finds them on the countertop, they're going to eat an entire bottle because they taste good to them. They, think, they actually think it's a treat. So we're seeing more and more veterinary drugs uh, overdoses, either in dogs or sometimes what happens is that we use a drug that was for one species on the wrong species. So uh, somebody giving a dog medication to a cat thinking, well, the cat looks like it's sick with the same disease. Rather than going to the vet, I have these leftover pills from my dog, I'm going to give them to the cat. And that's a huge no-no. You can't use the same drugs and same dosages across species. They're very species specific.